Hello everybody, this is Takopi and I welcome you in another video. In this video, I'm gonna tell you about Ace Combat Control because I've been questioned a lot that, hey, how, how do you bomb so precisely? And uh, we also wanted to learn because we have a super carrier and we cannot use bomber because we are not good at Ace Combat Control. It's very confusing. We always get our planes in under the water and whatnot. So the, all the questions, all the confusions I also faced when I was learning Ace Combat Control, it's really difficult. And in uh, YouTube right now, I have seen that uh, there are not much videos, only few of them. Okay. So yeah, <clears throat> I'm going to show uh, all my settings, first of all. Uh, so yeah, I have only medium graphics. Uh, if you want, you can just set it everything as low at the beginning because, you know, the more higher the graphics, more higher difficulty you will face. Okay, not not because of FPS counter, but because of that uh, sun flares that uh, you know extreme graphics you wouldn't see uh, where is your uh, aim is okay that that kind of thing uh, we face a lot when we put an uh, ultra graphics so i would suggest you put low graphics at the very beginning till you you know uh, get used to it so yeah uh, and others i have kept everything as you know medium to medium and low then the main part of the game is controllers uh, camera sensitivity is 50 percent uh, i have aim assist on because a uh, lot of times what we want our sh uh, our plane to have you know auto aim towards uh, that particular uh, habit on okay habit on at the very beginning at least then uh, acceleration i have not uh, kept on uh, show control stick yeah it is enabled because i wanted to show the control stick if you if uh, if you learned it mastered it then you can turn it off uh, yeah here comes main part aircraft controls uh, here you put ace combat control because that's what you want to learn then uh, control sensitivity i have set it to 50 percent uh, you can set it to anything but uh, yeah i would suggest uh, keep it default uh, till you you know learn it and then you can adjust according to your sensitivity needs okay and then you have a uh, camera assist also because that's what we want uh, our you know aircraft to move uh, towards the ship okay and then uh, other things i have kept off uh, don't put on vertical invert or horizontal invert okay that is an opposite part of what you will do okay if you say go above the sky it will go under the water okay that's what happens a lot with the players when they ke keep these kind of things on because it is confusing obviously anyone will confuse if i say go to right and you are going to left that is a confusing part and that is a hardest part to learn so that's why i would suggest that keep it off and uh, and and l let the game be <laughs> like the game okay so yeah that's that's the only thing which you require and other things are you know just uh, okay now go to ESS Enterprise or Shatam, anything which you have, uh, but I would suggest Enterprise. If you have already bought Enterprise, you can go to um, Shatam and you can try, uh, I guess Parkda also has one bomb dropper, right? So yeah, you can test that also. So yeah, we'll go to training module because it is a awesome place to learn these thing, kind, of, kind of things. Okay. Now, uh, yeah, <coughs> let's begin. All right. So here we are. Okay. Now what I want to do is I want to launch the bomber okay here is our b21 radar here are all the ships which are our targets and as you can see down there it is a small circle okay there is a small circle and what that circle means is that uh, if you if you dro uh, drop a bomb right now it will be dropped on that circle area but as you can see circle area moves a lot it is not stable at a point that's why you will not be able to move uh, and aim at a single ship which is not moving that much and it is on a uh, on a same same area uh, so in that case what will happen is uh, you know if you wanted to bomb drop on this uh, on this rock but but you can see that we didn't get even a single second okay uh, on the rock so what will we do in this case uh, in the right side you can see this uh, upper arrow and the down arrow so what the down arrow means down arrow means as you can see our bomber is you know uh, kind of very slowed in the air as you can see right it is not moving fast it is very slowed if i click it again it is a normal cruising speed okay it is a normal cruising speed of a bomber so uh, at this at this speed the normal bombers move but when you click downside arrow it will be slowed in the sky as you can see and if i click on upper upper arrow it means speed up okay it will boost up you can see the flares in uh, you know behind it uh, so yeah it, it actually shows that it is fast okay now uh, as you can see uh, there are controllers okay this controller is there so what uh, what i wanted to show is if you you know say control uh, if you control to right okay like this it will move to right 
if you control to left it will move to left but the pov of the bomber will not move you have to move it from with your uh, you know right thumb uh, wherever you wanted to see okay if you wanted to see the left side you will see the left side okay now if you wanted to go right side and also wants your pov like your vision also to be on the right side where the bomber is going right so in that case what will you do not only this but you will do this and also pov change okay this is how you will see where you are going if you stop stop the pov okay that's the simplest thing uh, that you can do okay if you wanted to go to left side and also wants pov to be left then turn left and turn your pov also to the left okay and this is how you'll see the pov changes now you can see the dot the green dot is very small and we wouldn't be able to drop the bomb from this above okay it is very difficult and ships move quickly so uh, till the time bomb reaches uh, the surface where the circle is ship has already passed that area no one is there okay so it is a useless bomb then uh, so what we want to do is we wanted to stay close to the ship as possible and then drop the bomb okay uh, but not too close because you will be blasted too so yeah so let's go let's go to the right let's go to the right where the enemies are let's go to the right now you can see there is this uh, uh, i guess it is enterprise or any other ship i don't know but now i'll slow down okay now i'll slow down why i slowed down because our enemies are very near to us and i wanted to slow down so as you can see there is this carrier in matron i don't know what's the name okay i'm gonna uh, okay so how you will aim at your ships okay so the main thing is the circle should be above ship okay that's the basic thing we wanted to con uh, confirm so uh, wh what we'll do right th side thumb will do nothing okay left side of thumb should do the all all the things okay if you left if you left if you right if you have to go right okay now i have to go uh, downside a lot so i'll go down i'll go down i'll go right i'll go right i'll go right okay i'll go right i'll go above above and then little bit of right yeah and that's the perfect spot okay now uh, now i can drop the bombs i will drop the bombs i'll drop the bombs i'll drop the nuclear and that's how you will drop the nucleus and then go and then go and then go yeah that's how you drop a bomb and get out of that position i'm doing this now as you can see my my uh you know circle go going up all long above i'll slow down the ship i'll pull it down i'll pull it down i'll pull it down also my pov should be changed also okay i'll pull it down i'll pull it down pull it down pull it down till it reaches the ship yeah pull down a lot uh, pull above a lid yeah and that's the perfect spot now right side a bit that right side a bit okay and now that is the perfect spot you can drop a bomb very easily right and you have dropped and ship will sink yeah and that's it ship will rest in peace under the water okay. now it is not that easy because this kind of thing is in the practice area here ships don't have their anti-air defenses okay there are a lot of missiles which can take down our bombers very easily so you have to be fast uh, now this is very slow thing which i have uh, showed you now i'll show you how i do it fast okay now let's go a little bit of down recharge ourselves go above okay now go target a ship okay i'm gonna target this one this one this bad boy okay this frigate i guess i'll slow down a bit i'll adjust my pointer i'll pull it down i'll pull it down a little bit of above i'll speed it because i wanted to go close now i have reached enough closeness i'll just blast it yeah and that's that's it that's it. now go again blast him again because we don't want him to uh, recover his health go speed up speed up speed up if you reach near target slow down slow down and then adjust the circle drop the bomb drop another bomb and that's it that's it let's go and uh, see in the offline all right now i'll show you in the offline mode how you do it if you if you have all the ships then obviously offline mode is the only option for you i'll use uh, um, what should i use yeah tu bomber would be great yeah let's go and use it in the iceland of iceland's because it's a big map and 
you get a lot of time to play <coughs> now let's go let's try to bomb I, the video will be long sorry for that but uh, it is important thing all right yeah now you can see this bomber is you know cruising its normal speed although the, this bomber is very fast but it is cruising in very uh, its natural speed uh, now i have lowered the speed you can see it is you know going very slow yeah now you can see uh, i have clicked on bomb it, it it's bomb dropper you can see right if you want to drop on this spot go down go down go down because this much time you'll get and you can drop the bomb very easily now <clears throat> now there is our target okay our target is very near it's Yamato I, I love to bomb Yamato okay because they are the easy targets to bomb and they don't resist they don't have their uh, powerful uh, what do you say anti-air defense all right now okay okay yeah now uh, I have reached very close now I have aimed and I have right 243 um, K straight out the box right. now let's go aim again I'm, I'm very fast right now okay now I'll slow down because uh, you need time to bomb okay now you can you know select this with the keyword uh, it with this right what I'm doing is I'm using my controller to you know move this uh, kind of thing uh, play as much as possible because it is not the thing which you can see and learn it by yourself but you have to you know uh, try it try it yourself learn it again and again you will draw a lot of ships at the very beginning but uh, but that's it that is necessary right until and unless you go under the water you don't know how to swim yeah. okay we have got our bomber and we will bomb this nanchang okay we'll go near to nanchang now bomb dropper i have selected slow down bomb let's go so all right i hope this video helped you uh, if you have any of the doubt any of the sensitivity settings if you wanted to discuss anything you can always you know ping me or you can uh, just comment on this video so that i can reply you i always reply to every comment so you can just leave all of the things which you wanted to say or if you wanted to criticize the video definitely you can comment down i i will take it as positive okay if you want anything i wanted to improve uh, if you want anything to be improved in the video you can drop the comment okay so see you until next video bye bye take care